Hello and welcome to Crack the Female Code again. This is Mike Colleen. This is Mike Colleen at MikeColleen.com at CrackTheFemaleCode.com is where you can buy my book. Remember, if you haven't already done it, click the subscribe button. I'm doing all my marketing right here. This is what I'm doing for summer of 2014, probably all the way through the summer. This is going to be like my major venue. If you want to get tips, find out where my seminar is going to be at, this is where you do it, okay? All right, let's turn the song down. I don't know if you can hear it, but I can hear it. All right, it's off. Turn it off all the way. All right, this one is uh, don't take it personal. It's not personal. All right, there. This this applies to a couple things. This might end up being a two series video. All right, let me do one real briefly. The second one's really what this one's about. I remember when I was in my twenties. You know, um, my girlfriend at the time was like, "Don't take it personal. It's not personal." And what she was talking about is when she would get on her period and right before when she'd get you know, really emotional. In fact, we, I, I had a nickname for her and she took it on afterwards. <laughs> but I called her Psycho Puppy because after a while, like, and this is something for guys, is like if you date women for years, you start to see their patterns. And especially if you date multiple women, you start to see how they, you could tell when like, uh-oh, here comes the hurricane. And I called that Psycho Puppy. <laughs> and I meant that in a cute way. And she, it was kind of cute because when it, I started to get to the point, I was like, Oh, you could see it. like something just kind of shifted. It was like, you know, about four or five days before a period, maybe a little more. And it was just a very subtle thing. And I said, uh oh, she goes, what? I go, psycho puppies here, huh? She goes, no. It's like, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, so sure enough, about a day later or half a day later, she would start flipping out and screaming out with stupid shit. <laughs> and I don't mean any disrespect. Um, and sure enough, about two or three days after, she'd come back and so I'm sorry, Psycho Puppy came out for a while. <laughs> and that was so cute, so adorable. And so here's the thing. I, it, I'll do another video on this, but I'm going to say this for now. Guys, it is not personal. Her, her hormones, the chemicals in her right brain are just flying all over the place. It's almost like being on steroids, having a roid rage. It's like, you can't fucking help it. You're flipping out. And so, again, I mean this in a very respectful way. What I'm trying to say is you need to stay grounded, which, again, I'll teach you in my course, and calm. Breathe through it. Relax. So if she can see that you're calm, it'll help her a lot because she's going through this emotional hurricane and – She's sensitive to every little thing, and she, it's hard to tell, like, what's real. What, are you being honest? And and she'll call you names. She'll say you're cheating on her. She'll accuse you of shit you've never done. And my point being is let the hurricane pass. It's a freaking hurricane. That's all it is. You need to be a rock. Rock of Gibraltar, something she can hold on to. See, if you start to flip out because she's flipping out, she's going to look for a better boyfriend. And that's what a girl's looking for. That's why when girls meet guys at clubs, there's lots of noise, lights, spinning around, lots of people, half of them are drunk off their ass, slamming into you. If you can stay calm, clear-headed, and grounded in those situations, then she's like, there's a guy probably that can handle when I go through my emotional turmoil. So, because a lot of guys, especially younger guys, when a girl flips out, he gets caught up in it. Now she's thinking, oh my God, he's flipping out, I'm flipping out, who's driving the boat? Literally, like, who's, who's driving? Not, not you guys. So that's why you got to be grounded, okay? It's not personal. I'm going to leave that at that. The next one is slightly different, not personal. Not personal too, we'll call it. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, click that button, do it. Come to my seminars. Take my one-on-one -on -one coaching. I will change your life. If there's one thing I can guarantee, you will have a completely shifted perspective. I call it changed perspectives. You're going to see things from all these different angles, which is a very healthy thing, by the way, which will help you out in every area of your life, business, sales, dating, relationships, etc. All right, this is Mike Colleen at MikeColleen.com. Take my course. See you.